anomaly. We done it, Spectral. Thanks to F Woods, the restoration only has uh, broken the director's hold on Penzil. Lord Pugh Louis Decimius has already pledged his house and his system to my source. The restoration is growing, just as we had hoped. And with his support, you gain territory, soldiers, and bolt and boastful supply chain. Not a bad deal for you, Lady Arano. Oh, for House the Missus. The Directorate took a, uh, took a scorch earth approach to Penzio's farmland without all, all ongoing support. The people would have starved. I'm not my uncle, old Darius. The restaurant gives as much as it takes. That's commendable, Lady Arano, but it may not be sustainable. Isn't like you. Uh, isn't like you had much choice. Letting them starve would be terrible, Peel. For, from a strictly pro pragmatic point of view, that's true. It would have helped these people whether anyone was watching or not. This is what I'm fighting for, Speckle. It's a victory to be sure, but we're still a long way from Cormodorum, and Director or Espinosa has just begun to marshal his forces. Things are going to get a lot more difficult as we push forward towards Smithern. The Director its military capability appear to be way out of line with our in initial estimate. Somehow, they've gained access to weapons Balmix that uh, are totally foreign to Oregon Reach. Where do you think all this hardware is coming from? We don't know. House Espinosa has always been, had contacts in the inner sphere. Lady Victoria's personal battle mech is a prototype model that's almost impossible to find outside the Draconis Combine. But this radical new military buildup is something else entirely. Wherever these weapons are coming from, it's recently developed and, and the, the, it's a recent development and a troubling one. Hey, Lord Madrun, I, uh, sorry to interrupt, but there's something that you may want to see, actually. You may all want to see. I found something strange on the Ol Olgo's nav computer. Why don't I like the sound of that? Because if your head is in the right place. I found something weird on an ancient ship, is what space would say in horror movies. That's true. <laughs> Usually right before everyone starts dying. Back me up on this, Doris. Well was the one you made me watch the other day with drones that started eating people? Count Horotomo de Sword. <laughs> it was a funny that email. It was gears or teeth. It's a great film, but that's all it is. It's make-believe mail. Dr. Murad, please tell us what you actually found. Well, it appears to have stumbled onto an encrypted data archive. Somebody hid it away in the Olga's second day storage drive. That just might be my, be uh, my best guess, mind you. Star League era encryption software isn't really my expertise. My father spent years trying to figure out a way how to get the Argo back into a rig in space in one piece. He was obsessed with this ship. He felt that it is important somehow. And now this? I want uh, uh, that archive open, Dr. Murad. We need to know what's inside. With all due respect, Lady Urano, whatever's on this disc was sealed away for a reason. I've heard enough stories about lost tech uh, of treasure war hunting to know that it's a bad idea. So why don't we just leave it well enough alone? Because this archive could contain something of value. And because, as I previously mentioned, I have a personal connection with this ship. I believe that this discovery is meant to lead us somewhere. I intend to follow it. Lady Arano is our client, Mayor. If she wants something, if she wants to check this thing out, then that's what we're gonna do. That is what I want, yes. And thankfully, we can follow this lead and pursue our campaign against the director at the same time. The liberation of House Corosis on Simathana is already the restoration's next objective. And Lord Simon Coros was my father's chief technologist. Scoring the ship. 
Securing the help we need will cost us nothing that we won't already planning to pay. Perhaps this is just a coincidence, Miss Mail, but I cannot help seeing the hand of fate at Wolku. <clears throat> Master has taught me to pay heed to my intuition, and that is what I intend to do. What do you think, th think this Lord Corosis will, will be able to open an archive? Because he knows lost tech better than anyone in the reach. And the day my father reigned, whenever scraps of te foreign technology were discovered in the reach, they would take him to Smithathon and cat uh, uh, cataloging and st for cataloging and study. If there was an answer to be found here, we'll find them with him. That's a plan. After we liberate Simathon, we'll have an audience with Lord Kaurusus. Yes, Beckle. And shortly thereafter, we will see if my father's intuition about the Argo is justified. As before, I will contact you when we're ready to move on Simathon. For now, I'll take my leave of you. I have nobles to palisade and an army to rally. And you have your own contracts to pursue, I'm sure. Yes, we do, Lady Rano. Keep... And keeping busy just as you asked us to. You all hold hold. We've got uh, some time before the next leg of the restorations uh, often uh, offensive, and our client wants us to make the most of it. Time is money, so let's get back to work. Later on, as people scored the spacecraft uh, after they found a jackpot uh, commander, this commissioned griffins. Lots of them. They'll, they'll never get it, them working with the pearl facility that they've got. But between my team and the Argos Mech Bay, I think we might. You can find in them in the shop here in Panzerul. Griffin would be really nice, actually. The Dragon 1 in is a beefy machine that can take some serious speeding, but tends to be a bit light on weaponry. It moves fast for a heavy mech, though, which, which makes it well suited for closing for melee attacks against slow targets. Glitch died. Still breaks my whole. I'm listening. Receiving you. Waiting for orders. Yeah. Commander. Aye aye. Okay, so. Do you really need a griffin? New weapon systems available. Okay, so let's go to Mech Bay. Got some pills to make.
Okay. Jeez. A little bit more accuracy and crit. Yeah, let's go back to the shop real quick. Okay, yeah, we'll grind it. Strip equipment. Okay, so it just so that's a forced mech. You couldn't hang on till payday. Well, scouts have absorbed pirate mil military units. Convulsing survey mill additional targets, increasing activity in local several priority facilities suggest a strike is coming soon. 
the scout lands that in order that's it. Eliminate them before you can pull back. Oh right, we can't. Dang it. I've got the financial report. Travel was a need. In the daily briefing, Samuel brings up an open hail from Elisha. They say that the crew has contracted a bold case of that the local government is preventing them from landing in a mess. See milk okay. We could tell them someone was fired. It would limit us. In the mech bay for a bit, but given the situation, I'd say I expect them to pay us. Suspicious to stick together, Commander. Besides, the local authorities might appreciate our generosity. It's true. Uh, I hate myself. I hate myself. I hate myself. I hate myself. You, you're not at Dr. Murad. We're only one bat, uh, bug away from the same situation ourselves. Make arrangements for transfers of supply. Over the next several days, four trickles through the ship about your decision, and a large contingent of long, lifelong spacers in the crew expressed their support. Samuel also passed along the message of thanks for the, from the plant's office for resolving the situation favorably. Yeah, I guess. Hey, boss, we've just completed those upgrades. All right, I'll get the team on it right away. We have to be doing something productive, I'm sorry. Yeah. Let's go back to Valdry. Violation trouble. In the daily briefing, Doris brings up the bracket, the barracks climate control system. Apparently, it started cycling randomly between Tarble and the inside of a mech cockpit in a desert. Dr. Murad just shrugged. I can replace the fan controls again, but it may not. Uh, but it may not be money well spent. Something else is going on in, in the unimproved. Going on in the unimproved power conduit, but the algo is very old and very complicated. Tracking it down has been difficult. <clears throat> Dr. Murat, okay. Be on your own time, I guess. God, I still can't believe we lost Glitch. That 
it's really heartbreaking actually. That work order is complete, boss. Top notch work if I may say so. What brings you down here, Commander? <clears throat> Twenty days. Twenty days. Thirty days. Twenty days. Yeah, Should we can we really use this It'll actually. Bit, we'll get it done. Distress call. Something catches your attention on the bridge. Commander, I've picked up a distress signal from. Mount an immediate rescue expedition. When the auger arrives at the source of the dress beacon, it's clear that you made the right decision. A handful of void suited passengers spin aimlessly away from a gaping hole in the knoll in the hole, hoping ag against hoping against hope for rescue. The tech staff managed to scoop them up the survivors just before the transport exploded. Oh nice. Uh, little too close. Yeah, for good decisions. I swear, being the good guy is gonna bite me in the ass. Happy accident. Darius opens the morning briefing with a scowl on his face. We picked up new supplies a few weeks ago, and now, and we're just now opening some of the crates. It's a machine tools. And well, I can't believe this happened again. But Yang practically explodes from the show. We have more frozen uh, triple F bowl meat. Do you know how hard this stuff? Uh, is to come by in the periphery. Dr. Murad sighs audibly. Please tell me that the refrigerator was still operational. I don't want a repeat of last time. Don't worry, Doc. My team will take care of the good thing. Flashes. You a winning smile. What do you say, Commander? Bulls on the menu? I'll go hypothonics. Haha. An idea pops in your head. Chef. You're kind of an expert on triple F bulls. Do you think that the hydroponic garden has what you need to create the real thing? Yang's face takes on the Sony expression that you've come to associate with complicated refit rules. From what I've heard, this stuff is basically whale meat, so I'll have to improvise, but yes, challenge accepted. By the end of the week, Yang and his mech techs had raided the garden and retrofitted a blast furnace into a makeshift grill. Somebody even decorated the mess hall in triple S trade bulk coals. <laughs> well, only those who've traveled to Davian space can attest to the accuracy of the bulls. Everyone agrees that they're delicious. Woohoo! Plus two morale. Good choices! Get more fast repairs done. Oh, 
No, I can't really do anything until we freaking get the dragon up. Got a new financial report for you, Commander. Let's take a look at the hiring hall. Keg stole. Flankle. Aye, aye. Yes, Commander. Yeah. All right. Nothing too interesting. Ah, oh, damn. There's five weight different. There's five tons difference. Okay, we got the dragon. Yeah, let's use this one. Okay, so we got the bell minimum. And not dropping into a. I guess I could have done that. Damn it! Hold the line. Gimme, gimme. Launch contract. Oh wait, hold up. Before we do, actually, we got mech wolves I can probably train. Receiving you. Solid five across the board, but isn't bad, especially for Manusa. Standing by. I'll wait on this one actually. Okay. Good knowledge, good knowledge. Satellite surveillance picture shows that a heavy lance was inserted onto the plant source by the director of dropship. Go for whatever operation they have planned before they finish killing the area. We would like you to interrupt them. Though heavily armed, so expect strong resistance. If they just sit down, they may not be battle ready. You might catch them with the medical cold pants down. Okay. That's a lot of money, so I'm kind of concerned about the threat level here. Ooh. 
But hey, you know. The fiercer the foe, the sweeter the salvage. Begin the mission. Command interface initiated. Well, the good news is that there's a lot of trees here, so we can use that to our advantage. We'll go. Moving to position. A lot of tanks here. Shriek PPC carry all. Standing by. Going full throttle. Alright, good hit, good hit. No vehicle coming up. Aye, aye. Commander? Affirmative. Boom. Enemy unit destroyed. Oh, demolition. What? Ready for orders. Are you kidding me? Well, Spectral can be killed in action. Firing. All Freaking hell. Demolishal got him in the head. That's freaking stupid. Awaiting orders. Now I'm down to nothing but a medium lance. I 
I've been sensor locked. Still can't believe that happened. That was stupid. On the move. Receiving you. Got a lock on me. I'm here. On my way. I still can't believe that happened. I'm actually kind of salty that happened, actually. I mean... You've got a sensor lock on me. If it were to happen to anyone else, it would have been a lot worse, but... My gosh, that was stupid. Okay, they're not getting this. So I made the right move killing that tank. Yeah, I know, I'm probably not being very evasive. I'm not being very exciting by just hanging out in this bush, but this could get really bad. Griffin. Firing on target. Okay, yeah, there's no mech down there. Move. No good. Order received. 
Locking on target. Target's taken a critical hit. Nice. It's a quick draw. Nice. A wolver in the boot. Go ahead, come closer. Magical. Commander, I'm hit. Ah. That's annoying. Yes, Commander. Of course. Wow. You failed to take out his leg.
You've got to be kidding me. Oh my god. This is literally the most fucked up game. From position. Oh my god, that thing is so stupidly bulky. This would have been so much better if I didn't friggin' get headshot on like turn one. On my way. So was you right? Armor blow through. Internal 
damage. Commander. Location confirmed. Waiting for orders. Acknowledged. Standing by. Heading out. Target acquired. Think I hit something good. Waiting for orders. Ah, oh, dang it. Critical hit, Commander. Hoping that knock him over. Oh, it did! Nice. Last, last time, Commander. Mission successful. Jesus Christ. We probably lost Talon. Inspector was going to be out for several days. Oh, that's terrible. Entire mission was terrible. Oh, damn. Eight, 105 days? Are you kidding?
me those. 